Ken is repeating the presentation he gave last week, now titled, Where Do You Come From? This features project two in the CC manual, which Ken is completing the second time. Have you ever wondered where do you come from? Did you ever wonder that? But you're thinking like the birds and the bees stuff, and maybe the stork brought in. <laughs> Not only it's the soul, right? Oh, that. Where Where's your soul come from? Interesting. Because I wondered something like that, but it wasn't about the birds and the bees and the stalks. I was wondering where did I come from? What people did I come from? Who my ancestors were? Which people did I come from? Now you could find out that information if you go online and you use uh, Ancestry.com or uh, uh, Genealogy.com. But I did it the old-fashioned way, with photographs. And I found something out that was shocking. So shocking that you may want to hear about it. And it may help you if you ever search into your background to see where you came from. Now these photographs were photographs that my Aunt Dottie had. My Aunt Dottie was my father's sister, and she was the family historian. Like, do you have a family historian, somebody who knows everything in the family? No? Okay, maybe you're lucky after you hear this story. Anyone else have <laughs> a family historian? Someone who keep, you, keeps all the photos, right? Yep. And she had the photos in a suitcase stored in her closet for years and years and years. So she had photos of the family back in Poland before the turn of the century, where my family comes from. And one time we took out these photos, and my aunt, my aunt Dottie, who was even an older woman at that time, you have the picture, kind of short, a little plump, blondish hair, she stood next to me and said, Ken, it's about time you learn who all these people are. So we went through the photos, and you can imagine old photos, what they look like. You know, all kind of ripped up, thrown every which way. And she pulled one out, and she said, oh, Ken, that was my father's sister's son. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and you write that down on the back. And she pulled another one out, and she goes, oh, that's my cousin's cousin, cousin two times removed. Okay, I write that down. And then she'd find another one, and she'd say, I don't know who that is. <laughs> okay, and there were hundreds of photos, hundreds, you know, a whole suitcase full of photos. And I'm looking, well, I guess that's where I come from, right? A suitcase of photos. But finally she pulled one out. She held it up and she said, oh, Ken, this is my mom's, now, her mom would have been my grandmother because she was the sister of my father, so her mom was my grandmother. She said, this was my mom's mother and father, my great-grandparents. So direct line. I looked at that photo, I was shocked. I come from them. I was shocked. <laughs> I bet, would you like to see that photo? Yeah. 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 All right. So I'm going to show you Tim's back. <laughs> We first put the input on to the rest, see if I get this to DV page, one more, I keep pushing, I need four. I <laughs> uh, just went dark. Oh. Oh. You're back. Okay. I looked at that photo and I said, I came from them. Those people? I mean, <laughs> Look at that face. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> ten years maybe. Or Chinese. Or or him. Look at that face. I'm looking at you. <laughs> I came from them. Total. You know, it's almost as if they were from Mars. They were so foreign to me, it's like they came from another planet. The only thing we share is DNA. And then my aunt gave me a neck chakra in only the way she could. She said, Ken, he was a Turk. <laughs> a Turk? They're in Poland and he's a Turk. Not only did they come from Mars, they came from a part of Mars called Turkey. <laughs> I was completely shocked. It was, I could not relate to these people. And it took me a while to recover from the fact that there was nothing I had in common. Look at the clothes. Look at that. Look. So this, I figure, is sometime around the turn of the century. So it's probably more than 100 years ago. So what I learned, and this might be useful to you, that if you want to know where you come from, where you come from, and you want to look at old photos to find out about your relatives, you might be shocked to find that you have relatives that you can't relate to. And maybe you shouldn't even look. Wow. <laughs> Thank you.